What is going on guys? Boy Trent is back with a video and today's video we got a custom jersey video for you guys today and today's jersey this is coming in from fansidea.com now I will say if you're interested in checking them out or getting a jersey for yourself I will post a link to their website in the comments and the description as well too but this website you can customize jerseys for baseball, football, basketball, hockey, soccer, any sport you name it this website can make jerseys for many different sports and also many colors, many designs, and also many different sizes as well to choose from. So for me, I'm a huge Ole Miss fan. I love all the Ole Miss sports. And right now, baseball season is going on for Ole Miss. So, hey, I decided to make a custom Ole Miss baseball jersey. But also right now, here in 2023, our best player is our shortstop, number seven, Jacob Gonzalez. So for Ole Miss, our colors are red white and blue and our blue we have like a navy blue but also have like a powder blue as well too so i decided to make myself a custom kind of like a powder blue slash white custom Ole Miss baseball jersey so i will put this on and try it on in a minute but my size is extra large and then this is the front of the jersey which has Ole Miss on it there is Gonzalez's number number seven and then this is the back of the jersey which has his name on the back. There's his number. And also, I went to the game this past weekend, and also I got Gonzalez to sign the jersey himself. So what's also cool about these jerseys is, you know, if you want to wear these jerseys again, if you want to, you know, put them up like a souvenir, uh, if you want to put this inside a frame, these jerseys are also great for getting autographs. Now, I love collecting autographs. You know, if it is jerseys, if it is helmets, balls, pictures, cards, whatever it is, these jerseys, they look great for autographs as well, too. So now, guys, let's put this jersey on. I'll show you guys more details also here in a minute. Okay, peeps, so the jersey is on the table. It is all spread out. Now let's take a closer look at the jersey. So starting at the very top left corner. First of all, we got the sleeve. Now, I will say what stands out immediately with the jersey is the color the color it, it's just popping now i love the baby blue powder blue look to it you know it kind of has that north carolina tar heel look to it you know a couple of professional baseball teams kind of have that same color blue look to it as well too sometimes you know kind of like like the vintage st louis cardinals jersey the phillies have a similar blue uh, even the rangers kind of like a similar powder blue to it the color stands out immediately but also on the sleeve, I did put a little white on the sleeve as well too. Since Ole Miss's colors is red, white, and blue. Decided just to do blue and white on the jersey. But the sleeve and the color standing out so far. There is my size. There's a tag. Extra large. We'll come back to the buttons in just a minute. But now moving on to Ole Miss. Gotta say this part. Wow. This is the letters, the font. The design, the look, the stain, it is looking sweet. Love it, love it, love it. Now also, here is Gonzalez's number, number seven. Also the number seven really pops out, which is great, which is awesome. And all these letters, all the numbers, they're all stitched. You know, it kind of has that professional look to it, which I really do like as well too. Okay, so now going back to the top of the jersey, I put the blue and white lines all the way down the jersey but now going back up right quick you know a couple buttons on the jersey we got one two button number three there's four five six six buttons on the jersey but also going back to the top where you have O and miss here in the middle the part is velcro so if you don't want to use the buttons attached to the jersey, you can just Velcro it. So kind of like the options, you can Velcro it. You can use the buttons on the jersey, whichever way you want to. So now, peeps, that is the front of the jersey. So now let's turn it to the back. Okay, peeps, now back at the jersey situation. So start from the top left again. We have the same line, just like the front. Also on the back, has that blue and white wine to it. Also the neck, has that same wine. And also the other arm sleeve, the same wine, same design. Now moving back to the top middle, there is Gonzalez spelled out. The letters, the stitching, 
Just everything. It looks great. It looks awesome. It looks professional. So there's a closer look at the letters. Okay, start from the top. There's the G. There's the O. There's the N. The Z. A. L. E. Z. Gonzalez. Okay, so then there's Gonzalez's number, number seven. And you know, once again, these jerseys are great for autographs. If you want these jerseys signed, if you don't want them signed, that is your choice, your decision. But me, I love collecting autographs and the jersey autograph, it really does stand out. It looks great. It looks awesome. The autograph just even makes it look better. So that's a huge plus as well, too. But the jersey... It is signed in a blue Sharpie. So, of course, you can get this signed in a blue Sharpie, you know, black Sharpie, just whatever color you want to. And now, moving on, this is the bottom of the jersey. Moving to the left side. Yeah, once again, I got to say the color, it pops. It's great. The color really stands out. That is a huge plus. And, hey, the front is looking awesome. The back is looking just as great. Loving the jersey so far. So now, guys, let's put it on. Okay, peeps. So we just want to kind of walk back and forth here for a minute. And also, I will show you guys how the jersey fits on me in the stomach, upper chest, the arms, and all that good stuff. Okay, peeps, so the jersey does have two options. There's a Velcro area, and also there's an area where you can attach the buttons. So first of all, let's do the Velcro. So the Velcro part is at the top of the jersey, where O and Miss is spread apart on the jersey. So this time, Velcro only, no buttons attached. Okay, so now let's take the Velcro part off, and now let's attach all the buttons. So the baseball jersey does have six buttons on the jersey. The buttons all go in, all attached, pretty easy. The Velcro part, no problems there either. The Velcro worked pretty good. Okay, we are done just like that. The jersey, the thing's looking sweet. Okay, peeps, that is going to be it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoy the video. If you're interested in getting a jersey for yourself, use my code SIP12 at checkout. But guys, that is going to be it. If you could please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already, it would be greatly appreciated. I'll see you guys in this video. Have a good one. Your boy Trent is out. Peace.